What is up everybody on YouTube? It is my birthday here with another video and today's video is going to be a Air Force One low review. Now this one's going to be a collab with Undefeated and Undefeated every time they work with Nike is one of my favorite times because I think like 98% of the collabs, the majority of them, I think they're always fire. I personally always have liked them. So um, I finally have a pair right here. Um, I actually have another pair from the pack. It's actually gonna be the Dunk Lows. Let me just show you guys, okay? Now this shoe was released on this date right here, wherever it's at, and it was released in two different uh, shoe styles. There was the Dunk Low and then the Air Force One Low. Now I was actually trying to go for the Dunk Low and accidentally went for the Air Force One. Um, don't ask me how that happened, it happened, and I accidentally checked out <laughs> for the Air Force. I was like, no, I didn't want to do that, but honestly, I was super happy that I did it because the colorway is fire. And here is the shoe, and here is that colorway. Matches the fitted perfectly right there, you see that? Now, if you're wondering what the Dunk Low looked like, it looked like this. Boom, this is what the Dunk Low looked like. Actually, the Dunk Low had this swoosh on it, but I took the swoosh off as I'm going to replace it with a different swoosh here later. If you wanna see the on feet for this one, it's gonna be here pretty soon. I'm not too sure if I'm gonna do a review, but definitely gonna do an on feet for you. So boom, here they are one more time. These are the undefeated Air Force One Lows right here. These are so clean and so sexy, guys. You guys do not even know it. Um, I'm actually super pleased and super happy with this purchase. These are nice. I just gotta say they are nice. So these are from the Dunk versus Air Force One pack, like I said, with Undefeated. Here is the box, it is gonna be in blue. Nothing too crazy, nothing too special. You can see it has detailing from Nike and from Undefeated, which we always love detail here. Detail is always a great thing. Now, as far as the breakdown on the shoe itself, it's gonna be made out of black and green colorway parts. Now you can see there is gonna be suede on the darker parts of the green. That's gonna be more of a suede, olive -y. And then right there, army green is gonna be more on the quarter panels or even on the toe box. That's gonna be more of an army green. Now on your midsole, which is actually really, really cool. Now your midsole is gonna be actually like an aged colorway. It's gonna be like that yellowish aged or sale you could say. Now that style has actually been very popularized lately. And so they kind of incorporated here on this Air Force One. Now, one piece of detailing that makes this shoe really nice is the black thread on that midsole. It just overall, you can see the contrast with the black swoosh, the black lining, and then the black laces with the black tag, and then you have the black outsole. Overall, just goes great. And then you can see right there on the back heel and then on the heel tab, you do have Nike Air and the undefeated logo, both embroidered there in black. Super clean, super, super clean look, guys. You don't even know how many compliments I've already gotten on this shoe. It's in fact, <laughs> I don't know, this is crazy. When I post shoes on the internet, on my Instagram or my Snapchat, which you guys can see right here at Yaman Alberto, definitely follow, um, I do post daily. People were just going crazy. They were like, yeah, we messed with this shoe. This actually is a fire shoe. Now I do get replies on most of the shoes that I do post, but this one actually stood out to a lot of people. I had a lot of people comment on this one. So this was actually a really solid purchase. Now, as far as sizing on this one, I did go for a size nine, and typically how Air Forces run is half size big. My true size is a size nine and a half, so going down to a size nine was perfect. This fits perfect. This shoe did retail for $140, and I did purchase this off of the Undefeated website. I think after shipping, it was about $155. Not too bad for a retail shoe. Okay guys, come back from the on feet. I hope you guys liked this video so far. If you guys did, 
definitely give it a thumbs up as it does help boost this video up in the algorithm and helps grow my channel. And if you're new here, definitely subscribe as I do post Monday and Thursdays. I'd love to see you guys here on the next video. Definitely comment down below what you guys like most about this shoe or if you like the dunk in the pack or if you don't like this colorway or what you would change. Curious to hear your thoughts and opinions, but overall, I love this shoe. The midsole is just a different colorway. Um, it's just nice, guys. A lot of compliments on this one. This is a very, very nice shoe. If you have any questions, um, comments, or concerns, definitely leave them in the comment section down below and I'll get back to you. But that's going to do it for me, guys. One more time, follow my Instagram at Yemen Alberto where I do post daily content. That's gonna do it. Stay fresh, stay fly. I'm out. Hey, Here to catch a vibe, you might catch a little contact.